did um, the Halstead, um, you know, which honestly worked out great for us. It was, um, it was because we walked through the Olivia and yeah. like so many features out of the Olivia, um, out of your model home, we liked. Yeah. So we kind of stole pieces from Olivia and he put it into the Halstead. We, we, it was a lot of moving around, like moving this bedroom here, bathroom. And yeah. So we, we did a lot of like little things that like the, the hope, the Halstead just didn't offer but it fit exactly what we needed out of the house. I look at our house and you just feel proud. Like it's like the nicest house you've ever seen. Like that's how I feel when I see the house. It's, it's, this one, it's, it's our living room because I mean the fireplace, like that's what I fell in love with when I walked in the, the Olivia and you know, the two story living room. And the wall windows, it just lights up the yeah, whole Yeah, it's very light and, and bright in here. Yeah. Um, well, two pieces of advice I would give, and one would be as far as your safety net goes, whatever is recommended to you, just maybe add like 10 grand to that just in case, because you never know what can happen whenever they break ground. And that's not foreseeable, like nobody can predict that just, you know, that's just my piece of advice. And then the second piece of advice is what I would give is just enjoy the process. Like, you know, this is, this could be a once in a lifetime experience and you really just want to enjoy watching your dream home get built.